Hey guys, today we're going to be doing a gothic love daisy look. And it's like a purple, little black, um, and it's really fun. I really enjoyed making this look, and I hope that you guys enjoy it. So we're just going to go ahead and start by priming our eyes with e.l.f. eye primer and liner sealer. I'm going to take the eye primer. Sorry about that. This is just a nude eye primer. You can use a white, but this just works. So. I'm just going to blend that with your finger up to the brow, into the crease, down to the lid, and out. Okay. So then you're going to start by taking, we're then going to do a professional eyeshadow brush. We're going to take a little bit of Flirty. It's a mineral loose powder by e.l.f. And it's like a purple. And you're just going to put a little of that onto your lid. It's like a grapey color. So just right onto the lid, maybe a little under the crease, and that's fine. So then, you're going to take your defining eye brush by e.l.f. Professional, and you're just going to dip it into a dark purple pigment loose powder by e.l.f. Now, over that dark purple pigment in your crease, you're going to take Glamorous by e.l.f. and put that in to soften. So we got a little too much, so we're just going to take our finger and wipe it down. So we're going to smooth it out our defining brush. Now we're going to take our e.l.f. blending brush and we're going to do circular motions in our crease to blend our crease shadow and our eyeshadow together. Oops. Now we're going to be taking our Elf Professional Concealer Brush. It's just a little flat tip brush. And we're going to be spraying a little water onto it. I'm going to put my water. So I'm just going to be spraying a little water to the tip. Shaking. Then we're going to dip it into a black pigment eyeshadow by Elf. We're going to give it a little tap. And you're going to just line the top of your eye right by the, cre right by the lash line. And then you're just going to bring it out and go under your lash line on the bottom of your eye. It can be a thin line because we're going to smudge it out later. I'm just going to take a little more of that black, wet it, So 
So now, we're just going to take our smudge brush. Our Elf Professional Smudge Eye Sponge. And we're just going to take that and we're going to smudge your black line to make it look like it's a thinner application but a thicker line. Now we're just going to take a little bit more of that black and we're just going to apply a little more to the under of your eye. Just so it looks darker. And we're just going to smudge that again. Now we're going to go onto our eye with the blending brush again. Make sure there's nothing on your blending brush. And we're just going to blend it out so we're going to drain a little bit of that color. Sorry, there's not enough on my first eye. Okay. So, now that we've got everything smudged and blended, we're just going to kind of pat our eyes under the side. Sorry. going to pat under our eyes and the lids to smooth everything out. Now we're going to close up and we're going to move on to our face and cheeks. Now we're going to take some of our ELF Professional Blend Foundation with SPF 15. And this is Light, which and it's a four blend of porcelain, fair, light, and beige. And those all make up my skin tone. So if you buy it online, you can like select which four you want in your skin tone. And when it sends to you, those four will be in a palette. You just want to work on making everything look really light. And just a tip. Um, if they have this little screen on them, whenever you buy minerals or pigments, when you store it, store it upside down so that you don't have to shake it as much. Now we're just going to do a little bit of Joy Blush by e.l.f. It's mineral, um, really, really light, really, really super light. I don't even know if you can see it in this camera. It's a mineral blush, and it's just so nice and light and fluffy, and it just feels really nice. And um, it comes out really gorgeous. So, yeah. Now we're just going to take our brush. We're just going to dust over both of our eyes. Just to get everything to blend really nice. Just one more time. Now we're going to finish this look with a little liner sealer by e.l.f. And the reason that we're using liner sealer is because instead of using eyeliner, we used eyeshadow. So this will give it that eyeliner look. Now, you can finish off this look with a lip gloss if you want. So, I am going to be using Elf Coral Matte Lip Color. And 
And that's your finished look. Thank you so much for watching and subscribe to our channel.